much. You guys have been through a couple of tight games, a lot of fourth quarter comebacks. Is, is, is that becoming a defining characteristic of this team? And what's it been like to not only do it once, but do it several times? Yeah, I think it just goes to show um, the character we have and what we're built on. We're never out of it. That's our mindset, and we just find a way to win because you know that's what's most important. Do you think that that breeds confidence for the next time around? I know each game is its own thing, week to week league and all that, but you can walk into a fourth quarter thinking we've done this several times. Yeah, absolutely. When um, the more you do it, the more experience you get at it, and um, you know you make that the culture around here is winning, and that's what we're building to. It's impressive, but I'm not surprised just from how long I've been around him. He's a pro's pro. He's been like that since the first day I got here. And um, yeah, we expect him to lead us and do a great job, which is what he always does. Jake, you, um, I, was, uh, I asked Matt about you as far as just, you know, your performance, you know, against the Saints and everything like that. And he just said that you're just a solid guy. Just expect the same thing out of Jake each and every week. Like, well, how is it to you know kind of like hear your quarterback kind of talk about you in that, in that in that type of manner? Yeah, no, I I definitely take a lot of pride in that. You know, I'm, it's my job to protect them, and um, yeah, I mean, I guess it can almost get boring. You want to do the same thing every game, and um, that, that's part of our job. And it never gets easier. It's it's a challenge every week, and. And it's a big challenge this week, so um, we got to be ready to play. It's going to be a tough environment, but we're excited. Now, I'm just curious, man, like, because you guys were pretty much able to contain Cameron Jordan, you and Caleb, you know, for the most part. It took like, about three minutes to go, he was able to get home. Like, how is it that, just for you personally, like, all right, you were able to get the guy, you know, contain him for 57 minutes, but in that last little bit, he was able to kind of get, a, get one of those, you know, get to Matt Ryan? Yeah, no, it, man, they're, they're, they're good players we're going against every week, and he's a good player, and the biggest thing is that we, we found a way to get it done and win, and as long as we do that, that's what it's all about. And we, we talk about it in team meetings. It's, it doesn't matter what it looks like. Did we find a way to get it done? Did we win? That's the bottom line, so take that every time. You know, like in the past couple of years, you know, a lot of people have talked about what the Falcons' identity is, right? And, and – um, and you guys, you know, like uh, Scott asked you earlier about uh, being able to pull games out at the end of the games. Do you feel confident in saying that that's you guys' identity? Like whenever, no matter what the situation is, you are going to find a way to win? I mean, I think that's a great identity to have. I think there's still a lot we can improve on, and we know that. We, we watch the film, and we know, you know, we got plenty to work on. But, um, yeah, I know it, it, it's kind of a boring answer, but the, the point of the game is to win. And... Uh, you find a way to do it no matter what. And if it's ugly, you take it. If it's a blowout, you take that too. So obviously we prefer the blowout, but um, yeah, man, it, it's the NFL. It's hard to win every week. So um, that's our mindset. Just find a way. Anything else? Hey, yeah, what are you seeing in Dallas' defense as we get ready for, for them and uh, you know, Coach Ben and what, what they're trying to do over there? Yeah, they're, I mean, first off, extremely talented. Uh, they've had a lot of success and they're, they're playing well. So um, it's going to be a challenge for us going there, being on the road, and um, we know it's going to be loud. And uh, yeah, having DQ there, obviously know him well, and um, we, we just got to be ready to play. And it's the same story every week, but um, you know, it's a big challenge. They've had success and we, we got to execute. Hey, Jake, uh, when you compare this season playing in front of crowds and the crowd noise and everything, Kind of, you know, open back up versus last year. Yeah. How does it well, yeah. Last year was definitely different. It was almost kind of surreal playing with that. But um, you know, I, I think it just comes with the more you play in it, the more you get used to it. At some point, you're not going to be able to hear. So th th that's a given. And we practice it enough to where we feel comfortable, where we can't hear, that we can, you know, make our calls and, you know, do the right assignment and be on the same page. But it just comes with reps and getting used to it. And um, yeah, I thought we did a pretty good job with that in a 
loud environment last week. Because is, is New Orleans like the worst place you know, noise-wise for a, a it, It's up there, yeah, definitely. Yeah. yeah. So what, what about Seattle? Where else? For sure, Seattle. Um, man, it, it, it depends, but you'd be surprised. Any stadium could get loud. The next thing you know, you don't hear anything because, like I said, there's a point where you don't hear, and it can get louder, but it doesn't matter. You can already, you already can't hear. So, um, yeah, you just you find a way to work through it, and we've always had a really good plan with that, with our silent cadences and stuff like that. What, what do you make of like all the upsets, like from week to week? You, you really never know. You think, you know, you thought, I thought New Orleans, New Orleans uh, is a favorite against you guys. You got, I have to have to replay all the ones from last week, but it just seems like every given week that's kind of always been the thing. Is that to like to play? In I just think yeah, that's the NFL, man. The, the margin is so close between every team. Every team is so talented. Everyone's got, you know, an All-American stud rushing the passer from, you know, everyone's good. So, and that's what's so hard about winning in the NFL. You, you can't get complacent. And, um, yeah, we, we're continuing to work towards that. And, be more consistent in our winning. Anything else? Great, thanks, Jay. Thank you. Thank you.